More than 100 Kentucky state troopers came to the state capitol today to be honored for their bravery and heroism. It comes at a time when the state is building a new facility to make sure they are among the best trained in the nation. WLKY's Ann Bowden is in Frankfort with the story. I'm here in Franklin County outside of Kentucky State Police Post new training center. It's being built and is expected to be finished in about a year. It's meant to help train the hundreds of Kentucky State Police officers that were honored today. For the land of the free. It's more than just a job and a career for us. It is a lifestyle. Hundreds of Kentucky State Troopers like Jack Hedges and their families filled the Frankfurt Convention Center to be honored. Hedges, from the Frankfurt Police Post, was nominated for KSP Trooper of the Year. It is something we deal with and we volunteer to do regardless of, you know, what dangers we face and it's something that we're trained to do. The medals for valor, bravery and meritorious service recalled the heroic acts from rescuing a DEA pilot and a state trooper in this helicopter crash in February as they surveyed an illegal marijuana field to saving citizens from tanker spills and leading people to safety during natural disasters. A lot of people don't see what really happens behind the scenes and uh, when people in awards like this, like the tankers and, and going out and wading in water and getting people off tour buses, they don't really, the majority of people don't know what really happens behind the scenes. Trooper Shane Goodall is the 2013 Trooper of the Year for a series of major drug busts netting over $20,000 and DUI arrests. He said he'd do it all for free. I think there's an innate quality, particularly in Kentucky State Police, uh, that when you hear the national anthem, when you hear my old Kentucky home, that there are certain moments that make you extremely proud to be a citizen of the Commonwealth and a part of our agency. And to further honor these troopers, in about a year behind me, there will be a seven and a half foot bronze statue, a replica of a Kentucky State Police trooper, here in their honor. In Franklin County, Ann Bowden, WLKY News.